Hi, my name is Chad Nelson, and I'm a Dynamics 365 Customer Engagement Solution Specialist with Western Computer. In this video, we're going to review goal management. Goal management in Dynamics 365 is a diverse tool that provides great insight into the data and help keeps everyone aligned with the overall business objectives. Organizations can measure defined results against specific targets. Goals can show estimated amounts versus actual value for a fiscal period, the number of products sold, the number of cases resolved, the number of new clients. There's truly an endless way to use the goal management feature. So we'll begin by clicking under sales here and we'll come under goals. So there's three components to it. There's the goal, the goal metric, and then the role of queries related to the goal metrics. So we'll begin by creating the goal metric first. You can see the three out of the box metrics already in place. Revenue, so we'll take a look here real quick at revenue. You can see that it's money based. So there's two types of metrics, count versus amount. We're gonna set this up in a very similar way. So it's actual money and then in progress. So We'll save and close out of here. We'll create new. And we're going to call this paid invoices. We're going to make that money. And now we're going to hit save. Now that we have the record saved, we're going to click under roll up fields here and we're going to add a new roll up field. And so now we're going to define the new roll-up field. We're going to go with actual money here. The record type will be invoice. Invoice, invoice. Source field is going to be total amount. The record type stage is going to be paid. And the record type status will be complete. And date field will be created on. That's for the actual. Now we're going to do one for in progress. And we're going to see amount due in this one. It's going to be set to active. And we're going to set that record status to build. And that's going to be created on as well. Go we'll save and close. Back here to the goal metric. We'll hit save and close again and now we'll come over here to goals and we'll create the goal so we'll begin with goal open this up here so we're going to name this goal summer of getting paid i'm going to make myself the goal owner I'm going to set the goal metrics that we just created, so paid invoices. I'm going to do this over a custom period. So I'm going to denote this as April. I'm going to make this the summer, so we'll go June 1st to August 31st. I'm going to set a target of, say, 5 million. One, two, three. One, two, three. And then there's a couple more things. You can see down here the actuals and then the goal criteria. So we'll hit save here. And I'll scroll back down and then we're going to recalculate. So we'll hit recalculate. OK. We come back. You can see here are the totals related to what's in progress, what's actual percent received. So let's save and close here, come back out. We'll go to active goals, and you can see the summer of getting paid goal has been set. The actual is almost 2.3 million. In progress is 184,000, so percentage of achieved is 46%.
Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel to stay alert of all the latest video releases surrounding Microsoft Dynamics 365 for sales.